It's Yukari. Are you awake? I wasn't, but then you knocked on the door. <laughs> Open the door. Good morning. Did you sleep okay? Slept like a log. Mitsuru Sanpai asked me to take you to school. Oh, how very nice of it. Are you ready to go? Well, let's see. I just woke up. I probably am not ready. I haven't had any breakfast, but sure, let's go. Okay, then let's go. Okay. Inside the new city passenger train, Ane Hazu. Hazu. Was this the thing I rode at the beginning of the game? We have to take the monorail to get there. Bet your last school wasn't like that, huh? No, I just walked for like 20 minutes. Also, I love this music. Just let it play for a little bit. This is my favorite part, when it feels like you're gliding over the sea. Wow, from I could see, but I just have this image. That's moving a little bit. And your image is pay is bleh, is staying perfectly still. <laughs> Our stop is Port Island Station at the end of the line. From there, we walk. Have you ever heard of Tatsumi Port Island? It's a man-made island. They built our school right in the middle. Have I ever heard of it? Well, I've heard of it in Persona 4. Oh, look, you can see it now. Oh, where is it? You can see it now. We're right in front of it. Morning. Morning, female student who has no character model. So yeah, for those who have played Persona 3 and Persona 3 Fez, you're probably used to anime cutscenes. Portable doesn't have that. <laughs> Yeah, saves me a bit of copyright issue. Morning. Yes, morning. You carry to the student with no portrait. Well, here we are. Welcome to Gekukan High. You're gonna love it here. I'm sure I will. I'm sure I will. You're okay from here, right? No. You should go see your homeroom teacher first. Where's the homeroom teacher? The faculty office is right there to the left. Okay. And that concludes the tour. Do you have any questions before I go? Yes, can you give me a longer tour? Which class are you in? Me? I don't know. I haven't looked at the classroom assignments yet. Hey, about last night, don't tell anyone what you saw, okay? See you later. Okay. See ya. <laughs> there are many people standing in the f in the front in front of the bulletin board. I always seem to put the in sentences where there shouldn't be. Right, press square button to select an area and go there immediately. Make, you know, please make use of this function to move around. Yeah, it's always putting the in sentences or missing entire words. Can I leave school? <laughs> you should go to the faculty office. First floor hallway, you should go to the faculty office. Second floor hallway, faculty office. Right, let's, let's talk to a few people then. Uh, let's see. Huh? The faculty office? Um, I think it's that way. Actually, I'm new here, so you should probably ask someone else. Lovely. Uh, let's see. You? What? I don't see my name! What should I do? What should I do? Check it again! Check it again! Still dead! <laughs> oh, I really should watch Non Peace again. <laughs> Actually, not Non Peace, uh, whatever. Purple Eyes is solely to adaptation is. There's no need for them to post the names of the kids who are going to be in our class. I mean, we'll never see them again after we graduate, anyway. Wow. Oh, great, I have the worst teacher ever. Is it Moroka? Because he's a dick. Alright, female student. Two students are talking. Oh, hey, you guys are portraits. Hey, Kaz, why are you wearing your PE uniform? School just started! You really ought to find somewhere to change into some normal clothes. Uh, I guess. Okay, okay, fine. Quit glaring at me like that. Hey, where's the bulletin board with the homerooms posted? It's right there! You're in class F, Kaz. I'm in a different homeroom, so I can't keep an eye on you. <sighs> I worry about you sometimes. I ship them. <laughs> right, male student. Hmm. Oh, there it is. Class F, huh? Taught by what? Miss Tori, you or me? 
Ah, oh, well, she is older than me, but I was hoping to miss her now. Oh, you're open for a specific teacher. Okay. Let's see, you have the angry mark on your head. Hmm, kids these days don't know how to respect their elders. Oh, how to show respect for their elders. Oh my god, me and reading sentences. We're their teachers. We've lived longer than them. But Moriyama and her gang had to pull that on me at the very beginning of the term. I'm sorry, sir, but I have to go. It's time to place my order. Even you're shooing me away. Some way to start school, yeah? I don't think my nerves can take this. Alright, I get it. You want me to order more of those cream-filled breads you like so much, right? You could have just asked. Oh. Someone's being a wimpy. Hey, hello there. Welcome. You seem interested in what we've got on sale. You must be a new student. I don't have enough bread for everyone, so if you want some, come early. I don't have any customers once school's out, so I can't sell that much. Alright, I have 3,000 yen. There is a yawn be gone. I would love that. Apple strudel, never had that. Cutlass sandwich, never had that. And book cover. Okay. So I guess I have to go to the hallway. Oh shit, I... Oh, I was able to go back. Right. Bulletin board. Class posters are posted. Oh, class rosters are posted. Ugh. You can't find your name. Check it again! There was a small note with your name on it. Minato Arizato. Class F. You look closer and notice that the name Yukari Takaba is also on the list. It seems you'll be in the same class as her. Alright, so there's Yukari, there's this guy. Wonder who else there'll be. Go to the library, go to the faculty office. Nurse's office, go to the faculty office. Bulletin board. Exam results are posted here. Right, you look interesting. A man wearing a kabuto who looks like a teacher is talking to a foreign male student. Do you see? Every man must have the passionate males. Why did I see male? Every man must have the passionate samurai spirit within him. At our school, we encourage our students to think like samurai in order to accomplish great things. That's fantastic. The teachings of Bushido are important then as they are now. Yes, yes, yes. You may not be a native of this land, but the spirit of the samurai flows for you just the same. They seem to be having fun. Yeah, I'll leave them be. Female student. Distressed girl. Huh? huh? Library? That's strange. I saw the map, but... Where am I? Oh. I wish I could help you, but it's not giving me an option. I want to help the classes, girl. Right, it's the faculty office. Enter. Lovely. Oh, are you the new student? Yes, I am. Minato Arizato. 11th grade, correct? I hope I spelled that right. Yeah, I did. Yep, 11th grade. The teacher was flipping through pages in a file. Wow, you've lived in a lot of different places. Yes, I've had a lot of expulsions. Let's see. In 1999... That was, what, uh, ten years ago? Your parents... <gasps> yeah, you want to bring that up? I'm sorry. I've been so busy I didn't have time to read this beforehand. All about the backstory. The protagonist's parents are dead. Just... FYI. I'm Miss Toriyumi. I teach composition. Welcome to our school. Oh wait, you're Miss Toriyumi. So I guess we've got that guy who wants to deal with a teacher as well. Also, what the fuck is composition? I've never had that in my school. I don't know what it is. If it's like English or something else, then please say what it is. Nice to meet wow, you. Such enthusiasm. Yes, I have a cynical enthusiasm to me. Have you seen the classroom assignments? You're in 2F. That's my class. Yay! But first, we need to go to the auditorium. The welcoming ceremony will be starting soon. Do I have to Follow go to me. it? Well, if you say to follow you, then sure. As you begin the new school year... The things I could say about this person, but... No. I'll just let the dialogue continue. I'd like each of you to remember the proverb... If a job's worth doing, it's worth doing well. When a 
applied to student life. This means the principal continues with his speech. Sorry, that's just my initial thought. Psst, hey, Al, oh. the student behind you is trying to get your attention. He came to school with Yukari this morning, right? Yes. I saw you two walking together. Yes. Hey, I have a question. Sure. Do you know if she has a boyfriend? No clue. I see. I thought you might know, but I guess not. I've only known her for like 12 hours. So how well do you know her? 12 hours. I hear talking. Teacher from her class. I believe it's someone in Ms. Toriyumi's class. Shh, be quiet. You're going to get me in trouble. Someone was asking me a question. You hear lots of people talking. <laughs> sure, lots of people do it, yet I'm the only one who gets in trouble. Homeroom is over. Your first after school session is about to begin. Sup, random person I can't see. How's it going? Not much. Who are you? Me? I'm Junpei Iori. Nice to meet you. Okay, I'm gonna say something about the English language, or at least this font on the screen right now, which pisses me off. A capital I looks the exact same as a lowercase L. And I don't know why, but it's just that looks like L to me. It looks like Lori. But no, it's Iori. So hello, Junpei Iori. I transferred here when I was in eighth grade. I know how tough it is being the new kid. So I wanted to say, hey, <laughs> see what a nice guy I am? Yes, you're a really nice guy. You have a goatee and a cap and everything. <sighs> Something wrong, Yukari. Hey, it's Yucatan. Yucatan Peninsula. Had to get that reference out of the way. I didn't think we'd be in the same class again. <laughs> At it again, huh? I swear you'll talk to anyone if they'll listen. Okay, I'm gonna pause on this sentence here. <laughs> look at the I in I swear, and then look at the L's in you'll talk. I'm guessing the I is a bit thicker, but still, it annoys me. Why must they look the same? Did you ever think you might be bothering someone? Ugh. What? <laughs> but I was just being friendly. I gotta admit, he was just being friendly. If you say so. Anyway, some coincidence that we'd be in the same homeroom, huh? Yeah, I know. It's just coincidence. It must be fate. Fate? Yeah, right. Oh. Still, I'm a little surprised. Um, hello. Are you forgetting that I'm in this class too? Oh, you two have sass. By the way, I heard you two came to school together this morning. What's up with that? Come on, give me the dirt. She's my roommate. <laughs> What are you talking about? We live in the same dorm. There's nothing going on, okay? Why are people even talking about it? Now you have me worried. Hey, you didn't say anything to anyone about, you know what, did you? Oh, you mean the gun, the dark hour, everything? No. Okay, good. Seriously, don't say anything about last night, alright? Should you really be talking to me about this in front of Junpei? Thought so. What? L last night? W wait a minute! Don't get the wrong idea! Listen! I just met him yesterday, and there's absolutely nothing between us. Yet. Jeez. I've gotta go. I've got something to take care of for the archery team. But you better not start any rumors. Uh, who cares? No one takes rumors seriously anyway. Well... She's so paranoid. But hey, it's your first day here and people are already talking about you. I'm not sure how to feel about that. Believe it or not, she's actually pretty popular. You the man! Okay. <laughs> this is gonna be a fun year. I can feel it. Popular as in... Yeah, fun year indeed. <laughs> There's not much I can say that, is there? No. You decided to go home with Junpei. Whoa, check out the jocks on the run. Say, uh, you thinking about joining a club? Uh, as long as it's not the D club, sure, why not? You'd be joining as a new member, though, so you won't be able to apply for a little while. Oh. You made small talk with Junpei as you went home. 
what am I saying to people? It's like, what does my character say? There's a sign-in sheet on the counter. You could save your game at the sign-in sheet. Welcome back. Hello. You know what? Let's save. Why not? Let's see. Oh. Oh. Don't mind this. This is a new game plus file. And don't mind this. This is a test recording. I had a little bit of fun with the names. Just saying. <laughs> aye. Aye. Alright then, so... I've been going for 34 minutes. Lovely. Only like a hundred hours ago. <laughs> you really shouldn't be outside on your own at night. It's too dangerous. Anyway, you must be tired. You should get a good night's rest. Do I have to? Oh, hi. What are you doing? What are you doing? Just killing time. Doing nothing. Probably pretty tired, huh? Maybe you should go to bed early tonight. I had a good night's nice sleep last night. I... Uh... Had a decent day at school. Why would I be already tired? The back door is locked. Big is. We can't allow you to go out after dark. Sorry, but rules are rules. Damn it. Hey, right, TV! We turned on television. It's a trend that just might spread all over town. Our next story is about the cherry blossoms. It's springtime, and they're all over town now. The Blossoms this year were a little late compared to other years, but they'll be at the peak this week. Lovely. Men's room. You know what? Might as well use it. Why not? So it's literally just audio of me flushing a toilet and washing my hands. Your condition has become great. Lovely. Right, so I guess I can just go back to huh? Akihiko's room. The plate says Akihiko. There's someone inside. Is that Mitsuru? I'm busy now, sorry, but could you come back later? Okay. Might as well explore this place a little bit. We have Ikari's room. Yeah, she's not in her room, she's downstairs. Mitsuru's not in her room. She is downstairs. Right, fourth floor. Door is locked. What's in this room? Nose on the door. Do not open if open, close it. Okay. So there's really not much I can do around here. No. No. Hello. Go back to my room and sleep. Why not?